Hello everyone, and welcome to my channel. In this video I will show you how to complete the new world quest, Chunu's Blessings of Sunken Jade. Teleport to Qingshu Village top left waypoint, and the quest will automatically triggered. After talking, press T, or the fish icon to interact with the orb to travel further. Head towards the navigated point. Teleport to Chaoying Village Waypoint and follow the navigated path. Head straight and interact with the fish and follow it. Press T, or the fish icon, and then throw yourself towards the mountain using normal attack. Continue follow the fish and defeat the enemies. Press T, or the cloud icon to take the flower energy. And now you have to activate the small flowers within the radius of the yellow circle. After activating it, interact with the fish again. Teleport to Yilong Wharf. Head straight and talk to the technician. Teleport to the right side waypoint of Yilong Wharf, and head towards the navigated point. Break the loose stone near the waterfall to reveal the platform, and press T, or the cloud icon to activate it. Jump down and proceed further. Head towards the watchtower. Jump down and talk to the boatman. Follow the navigated point. Now, you have to investigate two shrines. Use the orb on your right side to proceed with the first shrine. Press T to take the orb from the lamp and go to the top left lamp. Now press T again and the orb will touch both lamps and activate them. Take the orb again and do the same for the other two lamps. Now, press T again to investigate the shrine and collect the chest.
Teleport to the bottom left waypoint of Mount Lingmeng. Head straight towards the navigated point, and defeat the enemies. Press T, our cloud icon, to investigate the shrine. Teleport back to Jade Mouth Waypoint. Press T, or the cloud icon, to open the underwater path. Jump into the whirlpool and follow the fish. Jump down and interact with the glowing spots near three bells. Press T, to release the first Adeptal energy. Turn right and follow second energy. Defeat the boar and release the second energy. Use the orbs to go to the next area. Turn right and defeat the enemies and free the Sealy. Follow all three Sealies and it will lower the water level. Release the third energy from the ground, and follow the Sealies. Head straight and use the Adeptal energy to raise the Pyro Monuments. Light up the monuments to release the last energy.
Head towards the navigated point. Head straight towards the navigated point. Now, you have to collect the energy from the tree. To get that energy, you have to kill the enemy with the glowing mark on the top. Press T and collect the orbs. Enter the cavern and use the adeptal energy to clear the painting. After the cutscene, follow the fish. Jump down and investigate the object near the Sealy. Use your adeptal energy and take the statue. Place the statue in the glowing box. Head straight. Stand at the platform and go to the top. Use your adeptal energy to pick the statue and place it in the glowing box. Talk to Fujin. Teleport to Yaudi Valley. Head straight and kill the enemies with glowing spots on the top, and collect the energies from the tree.
Enter the cavern. Take the statue using your adeptal energy. Place the statue at the glowing box on your right side. Check the painting of the fish to enter another realm. Use your adeptal energy to the painting of the fish. Teleport to the bottom waypoint of Yaudi Valley. And then, teleport to Mount Xuanlian. Head towards the navigated point. Now, you have to collect three spirit orbs, turn left and glide straight. Take the branch using Adeptal skill, and place it to the opposite side. Now, defeat the enemies to get the fish statue. Take the statue and place it in the middle. Collect the first orb once it's glowing. Teleport back and go for the second one. Take the branch and place it to the opposite side. Take the frog statue and place it to the top of the platform. Now, take the fish statue and place it at the bottom of the branch. Collect the second orb once it's glowing. Teleport back and jump down. Take the branch from the right side and place it on the left side. Now, take the adeptal energy from the lamp. Turn right and send the energy to the other lamp. Collect the last orb once it's glowing. Teleport back again and head straight. Place the orbs to the fishes to trigger the cutscene. Teleport at the end of Chenu Vale, and talk to Fujin. Head towards the navigated point.
Defeat the enemies with glowing spots and collect the energy from the tree. Defeat the enemies and proceed further. Defeat the enemies and collect the energy. Defeat Lingyuan. Teleport to Chaoying Village. Head towards the navigated point to complete the quest. <laughs> 